we're saying goodbye to the Hellcat. Hopefully temporarily. I don't know if it's temporary. As you guys know, I bought this from Whistling Diesel. I bought it wrecked. I fixed it, was planning on lifting it, and then I wrecked it on the way to lifting it. And then it turned into a total debacle of issues and I never fixed it. And long story short, he hit me up the other day and he wanted to buy it. He gave me a price I couldn't refuse and now I sold it to him. So we're delivering it to the, uh, we're delivering it to the carrier right now. It's like a 10 minute drive. So we're on the final, this is the last drive in this thing. But he told me when he's done with it, he'll sell it back to me. So it might not be gone for good. It might just be gone for a little bit. If he keeps his word. He said I got first dibs when he's done with it. So I asked him what he's gonna do with it and I can tell you it's not good. <laughs> this, I'm sorry, Hellcat, but you're gonna you're about to be going through some shit, I'll tell you that. More shit than I put it through, because I put this thing through the ringer. I've have not treated this car very well. We should pop up a little a little montage of how I've treated this car. I'm about to do a donut back there. You think I'll get in trouble? Back there? Yeah. There's this camera back there. Oh, we're okay. You're gonna call the cops or no? No, no. No fine. cops? Okay. All right. I say we just send it, bro. Ready, Nate? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I gotta hit it in second. <laughs> Nate's tapping out. I say Nate. Hop out, yeah, Nate. Hop out, it's Nate. scary, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Be careful, please. I'm straight, bro. I know how to do it now, you gotta let go of the wheel. <laughs> that was it! I messed it up. Please tell me you got that one. These are brand new 335s. I, I know, totally we just destroyed them. <laughs> We are rolling out to Redneck Yacht Club. This is the rig right now. My truck's broken and we got no AC, so. Oh, 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 the front splitter's back there. <laughs> Still good. I ripped off the front splitter. He goes, you gonna flip that? <laughs> yeah, you wanna buy it? Hey, I kinda think it looks better. What do you think? Yeah. Um, All right, let's ride. <laughs> oh! <laughs> that was at the curb. Matthews, I almost hit you, but I was watching. <laughs> Oh my God, what are we gonna, oh my God. What are we gonna do? Let's go. Let's I'm go. kidding, I'm kidding, hop in, hop in. It's all right. I'll ride it on the rims home. You think we make it back to Florida like this? Oh, I think it's all right. Oh. The, the inner fender well. This is crazy. This is like like those hood rat kids at car meets. That's what type of burn, that's what type of burnout this is. Like in a in a like a civic though, usually. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bro, it's toasted. Is, do you know anyone that can patch fine. this? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, I got I got no freaking traction. Oh my bad. Don't scratch my bumper. Yo! Oh! Oh my god. Damn boy! I'm missing two. <laughs> And that one's loose. We were just ripping hard. Dude, I just found the lug nut in the middle of the road. Who the hell put that wheel on? What an idiot. I drop it. What was that? Oh, your Brembo's. Thank you, thank you. My wheel almost just fell off. Shut the fuck Swear to God. Can you say like, comment, share, and subscribe? Yeah, I just started a YouTube channel. I don't like shit right now.
like, comment, share, and subscribe. You heard the you heard the lady. Jesus, what the f look at this shit! I, I swear to God, look at what just happened. You think I might pop this out? Oh, I wonder how good I can pop it out. I think that's solid. Should we do it from the inside? <laughs> Gotta get it right, bro. That quick detail, three ninety nine. No. When you hire the homeless guy, the five bucks to clean your window. Yo, that's clean. Hell yeah. Yeah, that's nice right there. Yeah, that's nice right there. Look at this though. You think the people on the internet are gonna like this? I'm not even on, boy. <laughs> yeah, obviously. I, we can't build this in a day. You know this is the first in the world, right? You're looking really? at the first lifted Hellcat in the world. No one's really done it. Imagine seeing this, you drive by, you're like, what the hell? Dude, this is a disaster. They said they're gonna put you with the car. They're gonna give me a citation for being in the middle of the road. And he said, do you wanna drive my car? And I guess he was joking, I said, yeah. Oh, oh my God. I'm not gonna lie, bro, it is what it is. What it is. Whatever happened, happened. Like. Yeah, they're already here, but they told me I can say that. This is down bad. But I'm not gonna lie, this could be a lot worse. This could be a lot worse. Definitely. We were actually gonna remove that wheel anyway to lift it, so. Actually, we're ahead of the game now. Yeah. Because the uh, wheel's yeah, off. Yeah, technically, yeah, you got R. This is what you call a debacle. <laughs> I knew you were gonna say it. It'll buff out or no? So the good news is I already started on the lifted Hellcat for you. <laughs> like I just started disassembling it. Like I already got the rear end all taken apart. Okay. Oh yeah, that's fucking minty. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we had a little debacle. We're not looking too hot, to say the least. I already got the rear end taken apart for you, so I'm gonna drop it off tonight if that's cool. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, ka -chow. You know, I told this company to send me this wide body kit, Vicrez, I was gonna review it, so I'm honestly not impressed, guys. <laughs> like, I don't know what happened, it already broke, so. Take some JB Weld. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you know Whistling Diesel, Cody. I hope you uh, hope you enjoy this thing more than I enjoyed it because I had a lot of fun with it. I'm not gonna lie. Whistling Diesel, you, you better sell me this bitch back because the people want to see the lifted Hellcat. But the thing is, I'm not even ready to lift it right now. So that's why I'm even selling it to him because I wasn't even ready to lift it in the first place. I was gonna have to wait a couple more months. So hopefully he finishes with it and then I get it back. You know, that'd be uh, that'd be pretty cool. That'd be a cool story. And it is goodbye. Should I hit this? How fast should I hit this? What's up, man? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, you're good. Yeah, yeah, dial. You look good in that thing. You want me to take a picture of like Tinder? What? Instagram <laughs> picture? And your new Hellcat. Your new blocks? Yeah, yeah. I, I make videos. That's what this is going to, another guy that makes videos. Damn, curve the rim. What was that? Curve the rim. Right? Yeah. Good thing this thing isn't uh, showroom ready. This is, uh, the new guy won't care, I promise that. And neither do I, so you're off the hook. Oh, shit. Tearing those rims up. Oh. Damn, what type of delivery guy are you, man? In the, in the Hellcat. Good thing this thing's already abused. Well, gone, but not forgotten. I don't know what the future holds, but it's not, it's not looking so hot. But, you know, I guess we'll see. Thank you right, so much, man. Take don't, care. don't worry about it. What's up, bro? Hey, everything cool, huh? Yeah, going good, bro. How are you? Yes, Judah, huh? Yes, sir. Judah, in the Bible? Yes, sir. The tribe. That's a concept. Yeah, well, uh, Jesus' dad, no, he doesn't have a real dad, but no. uh, Joseph, it's, uh, what is it, Joseph? He came from the tribe of Judah. Yes. <laughs> the best tribe in the world. It's kind of cool. Yes. Well, I appreciate it. All right, brother. Have a good one, man. Thanks for the ride. And I'm now not a Hellcat owner, but the future is bright. We got other exciting things to look forward to.
Wanna win one of my cars? We go zero to 100, nigga, real quick. When it comes to everything on planet Earth, I think the butterfly is one of the coolest things that comes from disgusting little caterpillar, and it turns into this beautiful butterfly. And I was like, one day when I die, I wanna be able to say every thought, every dream, every action, anything that came to my mind, I went after it. I don't wanna leave nothing on the table. And I think Monarch, grow your wings, embodies that better than anything on the market, anything on Earth. But I wouldn't say we're starting small because any Anything you buy on my website starting November 1st is gonna get you entered to win my Jeep. This isn't a Jeep, this is a C8. My Jeep, my King Ranch, or my C8. This is literally a quarter million dollar giveaway. You're gonna get to pick which one you want. Monarch.com, a brand that I would live and die behind.